Hello and welcome back. So, uh, today I thought I'd uh, continue on my one Avis a day. So, <laughs> this time I grabbed the uh, uh, Avis 64 Ti 50 um, Titanium. Um, I picked, I got two of these from Uso. Um, by the way, thank you, um, Uso, uh, for awesome locks. Um, the other one I picked out of the package, and it was this one. It had uh, two keys, and this one has one key. So, um, I will put this one in the vise and see what we have here. Yeah. Um, and let's move you guys over just a little bit and zoom in. Sorry for the camera shake. Um... I'm going to grab my 40,000 somewhere here. There it is. There it is. Okay. Should be able to fit it in there. I can. It's nice and tight. And I'm going to grab my gem. And I'm going to start in the back of the lock as I normally would and search for a binder. And I think one bound. I got a slight click off of him. And now nothing's binding. Oh, okay, that was four. Three. This is an interesting one. Not your typical feedback. Getting some crazy clicks out of this thing. Keep dropping pens. One. And four. Wow. Okay. That one put up some fight. Now, I'll show you why that put up some fight. <laughs> uh, let's uh, zoom out. I purposely did not show you guys the key to this <laughs> because I happened to notice it earlier. Look at the bidding on that. Um, I think you almost have to specifically request that kind of bidding from Avis. Um, I don't know how well that's focusing. Let's put that behind a black background. Um, I have never seen an Avis with that flat a bidding. Um, there we go. That is, uh, that is about as flat as it gets. <laughs> but, very interesting lock. Um... Very weird feedback. Um, not no false sets. Um, just totally weird. Um, but I did want to show you guys this lock. So uh, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching, and don't break the law.